everyone, Jan and Adam are here. Today we are going to somewhere in Marbella. Not sure where yet because someone has the address. We need just to go there. So it's not just going to be a day out and enjoy yourself. So the plan is we will go, we will do what we need to do and uh, maybe we'll have a little bit of work and uh, maybe we'll have something to eat. So we will see. But that's the agenda for today. And uh, uh, lovely weather so yeah like nearly three weeks of bad weather and yesterday it was improving and <laughs> today it's even better <laughs> so uh, actually I was showing 15 degrees earlier and now my husband is complaining that I told him it's 15 degrees and he put his warm top on but he's like really hot and sweaty now so yeah. but he will be walking outside it shows 18 degrees now and he likes to take us through this little road where it's like all these bumps all the time I don't know I mean we're driving right now in La Linea, just you can see it's like the best surroundings ever you can find so yeah I just I don't like this little road but it's always like taking us here I don't know why well, you like to go through here the road's 200 yards so, long and it saves me an eight kilometer it's not saving uh, you anything you just like a little bit driving on the other side at least there is no bumps out there I don't know why you like to drive here so uh, that's it <laughs> Um, a little bit of road, maybe I'll show you, you know, to get to Marbella, I think it's about uh, an hour uh, to get there, so uh, yeah, let's see how it goes, it's a little bit uh, outside, that's uh, a bit of the view of uh, La Linea, which is finished now, and I have so much land here, always when we are driving this path, and look how much land I wasted, it was like nothing out there. Nothing. So empty. Look at that. They're gonna again have you take good use of it. I don't know. Like grow something on it. Like you know, build new houses. It's lots of land, and it's absolutely empty. It's just wasted. I mean, I can't look at it. I mean, on the other side is there are dunes. I mean, you can't see there is a, a sea, but uh, yeah, the dunes are protecting. I don't know. Maybe this. I've seen them. Um, there are some areas out there where they had uh, like um, growing something, but it looks like a abandoned or something. I don't know. Look how much land. It is. I don't think it's bad land. I mean, if you have bad soil, you can get soil a bit. Um, I don't know. All this kind of feel really strange. Why you don't use all this land? You know, <laughs> so much land that they still want to grow. <laughs> I mean, honestly. What do you want to rock for when you have so much land already here? With lovely climate, lovely weather, sea. I don't know. So, yeah. Okay, so we'll see you a little bit later. Um, show you a little bit of uh, the views. Where else we're going to see it? Uh, here. Let's see how the day goes. Just a little bit of Manilva. And there. Where it says Roski Center, this is where we like to go for the Indian. That's our favorite Pizza restaurant. Where it says Indian. Los Hidalgos. Mean India, yeah. I didn't notice the sign. <laughs> well, everybody knows the Roski Center here, so that's how they, if you're in the area, if you would ask where Roski Center, then you would find the place. guys we are in Marbella nice hello mom <laughs> nice weather sunny we are at the beach and I have no idea what beach is that and we're thinking do we need should we go this way or should we go the other way we the actually toilets. we came from here by the way the toilets here and they're free and they're clean and nice and uh, this is the other side and they have showers here look so, uh, where do you think we should go? Oh, look, exercising. Go stretch yourself. Yes. Let's, let's see how you can, should I make a video? Or? I would. <laughs> no, someone is no. going to be shy to do it. Oh, look, this, they, they're hiding the bins here. They are. Right, okay. Are you going to stretch yourself or not? No. You should. Hey, so we decided to go 
this way. way. Yeah, this way I think it looks like it's gonna be a marina. So we're thinking about lunch and uh, maybe we will find something this way because we have never been this way. I already have a video a while ago. I think a couple of years ago we've been here, no? In the, on the main promenade. And then we went on this side, so. It seems to never go to Morbea or like anywhere much. But hopefully now they will make a little bit. Okay, so now I'm going to show the name of this Playa de la Bajadilla. Okay. There has to be. Oh, someone has made this pretty little girl crying. Oh yeah, there's some cafes out there. Or maybe just a cafe, I don't know. We will see. I think it's going to be not much of the walk. <laughs> so just a marina it must be a really long walk really if you think it's all the way when we saw the other side this is the other side ah oh, so nice and uh, but I'm, I'm really hot now Are you looking at the places a bit? Where do you want to eat? No, I don't want to eat. Well, I mean, uh, I don't think we're going to see much here, to be honest. <laughs> don't you think? I mean, boats. And uh, pretty much, I mean, I don't know what's behind. Behind those buildings, probably we'll see a bit more sea. But not much to see here. And I don't think there uh, will be much places to eat here. So it was the wrong decision, really. <laughs> yeah, I know, but uh, I thought we wanted to go... Yeah, I don't feel like I want paella. I don't want anything big. I mean, usually we have a salad for lunch, so I want something light. I want something light. I don't want anything big. I think uh, I think that's that's it. It's more like industrial out there. I don't really. No, let's see. I think there is nothing very interesting out there. We should turn around now. Okay, going to turn around. Okay, so once again, Playa de la Bacadilla. We decided to turn around, so, and we are going back a little bit other way, so maybe we will find something more interesting on the other side. Wow, it's a nice weather today, really. You can smell the sea, yes. Wow, look, so this is a really, really long, long promenade. Well, there is nothing in there, actually. <laughs> I think it's going to be a long walk, actually, where where we went last time to the center <laughs> Have a look. you can listen you see at least nice and quiet in here look wow well i'm sure in summer it's not that busy here because i don't have my here is no cafe is nothing you see no so it's probably probably like good uh, to live here somewhere to be honest because this is the quiet part it's not road in front so it's just a nice and lovely promenade which would be really nice you know 
to walk every day enjoy the sea enjoy the quietness and you still have a little beach yeah where you could go and have a swim i wonder if water is warmer here in some you know i bet it is Okay, so this is February and uh, yeah, they also had very bad weather here last three weeks, the same as we had in Gibraltar, but still it's cold in Gibraltar, much colder. I, uh, I left in a warm jacket when we left from our car parking, it was, it's like, it's always cold out there, I don't know. Yeah, well, Gibraltar is closer to actually Africa, so you know it should be warm. I always thought it will be like really hot, which it is in summer. It gets really nice and hot, but and the breeze is helpful. But in winter, it's just too much wind for me. <laughs> I mean, here is always warmer, like a few centigrades is warmer than uh, in Gibraltar. But in summer, it gets really hot in here. Yeah, <laughs> okay. There are some pluses and minuses of all places, obviously. But our cold water is very cold in Gibraltar. I can't swim in summer. That's why I'm trying to like now do a cold water therapy, trying to adjust myself to cold water. So maybe finally I will be able to swim this summer. I don't know. We will see if I will have enough strength to continue with my <laughs> cold water therapy. I think that's the beginning of the main promenade, what do you think? Hmm? You don't know? Well, we're going to read now the name of this flyer. So, yeah, Playa Venus. Look, someone is already having fun out there, like a picnic. Nice. We never do picnics anymore. <laughs> I'm actually still not sure. I still can see more boats out there. So maybe I don't even know which part of Marbella we are. Where the where the center? <laughs> still this way? Or was it the other way? <laughs> I still think it's this way. I was actually quite surprised to find uh, the place we parked, it's free because it's like you have to pay pretty much everywhere but uh, that uh, so that must be not the center then <laughs> if it was free, <laughs> free parking yeah that's interesting, it's going up now, I still think we are not anywhere close to the center but anyway we will just have a little walk and it's getting close, near to our lunch time really, it's like what is already nearly two o'clock, yeah. So I think we will be going, looking for somewhere to eat. Oh, enjoyed our a short walk. I like that they have all of these exercising machines outside, you know. We do have some in Gibraltar, but quite a lot of them like broken and not much of the use. And uh, tourniquets they have, which we don't have in Gibraltar. I think they should put those tourniquets. We call them tourniquets, no? The ones you can stretch on. No. What do you call them? <laughs> bars. Oh, bars. What's the tourniquets? I mean, in Russian, we call it tourniquet. Oh, is it? No. Well, whatever. Okay. That's a little bit more view. I think uh, we we might not go. Oh, look, someone has decided to exercise. Yeah, I'm done now. You're done? Why are you like shy? Go and go back and exercise. <laughs> he's complaining he's too hot for this. Yeah. Nice. 
lovely. Okay. So we just uh, took our stairs and went up a little bit. Trying to hide in the shade. have a bit better views if you want to use it's more like a bar isn't it well okay we just like let's walk and then we can turn I think we're going uh, turn right in a minute to go eat somewhere in town I think we'll have a bit more choice than here oh look they're building new apartments I presume going on lots of uh, buildings going on in Spain in here when we came in 2015 we came or 14 or something like that everything was just uh, frozen like all buildings were standing nothing was going on and it's like since then a lot a lot is going on out there they build they build a lot around so now I think when we we should have looked at those properties, <laughs> shouldn't we? They had so many, like, had really good prices on them, and because quite uh, a lot of uh, buildings were unfinished and they were just standing empty out there. But now everything's finished and the price has gone up. But the only problem is to buy in Spain, you know, uh, ocupos, ocupantes, which are occupiers, whatever you call them. Squatters, that, that's the word. Yeah, they can just take your apartment get into it and just you can't get rid of them you just uh, you would have to uh, take them to court prosecute and it takes ages to get rid of them I mean like what kind of laws are those I always was wondering like who could come out with the law when you have it's your property and then someone jumps in it you can't get rid of them I think it is wrong it has to be changed just like in America right like in america you have your gun you got in my house and that's it you're dead <laughs> i think they should be everywhere like this here we are this is the center finally told you it will be this way it is the center so that's we walked last time when your mom came here it's all the way all that promenade all the way down no 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 definitely out there so we can either go and see a bit more there or we can go back to town and then go and eat somewhere in town, so it's up to you. I don't remember where was it. Well, we will go. Yes, yeah, so that's what I was saying to you guys. Because of those, uh, this kind of laws, we I always was scared to get anything. You know, that's why I said no. We don't have this in Gibraltar. <laughs> so, well, similarly, you have in the UK too, isn't it? I mean, France is also bad. Uh, not sure about Italy is the same. No, have the same law. But anyway, Spain is really bad. I know a lot of stories about this going on. And uh, it's just, it's ridiculous, I think. Absolutely. It has to be changed. The law has to be changed. I mean, it's like, let's say if you have an abandoned house and someone breaks into it, it's abandoned. Yeah, okay. People can stay there. But when you have your property and you have no right, I think it's wrong. I don't know. What do you think, guys? <laughs> Is it wrong? Do you want Do you want to share your apartment with some strangers who just would like damage it and 
I don't know, do whatever they want out there and you can't do anything at all. That's really out of my head, this kind of laws. So, yeah. Okay, I promise, we're going straight and then we're going to turn right. <laughs> I think you're hungry, no? I think Adam is hungry. Are you hungry? Yeah, hungry your face, what? Mestecito. Oh, how's lunch in, in Spanish? Desayuna is uh, breakfast, no? Yes. Yeah. Cena is dinner. And lunch? I don't know. <laughs> and he was telling me that he's fluent in Spanish. Live. Yeah, we were, uh, we were crossing the border and they asked us one sentence and we couldn't understand <laughs> what, he was, what he was saying. Nada declare. Nada para declare and we couldn't understand it, which is very easy. Do you have anything to declare? Yeah. And we both couldn't understand. <laughs> you had a funny accent. <laughs> yeah, of course. It's the accent. That's the problem. Okay, this looks like it's really busy now, that part. So, let's just, uh, I'll show the the last uh, way we walk to which play. Uh, oh, it's still Playa Venus. I thought it would be a different one, no. It still says Playa Venus. Well, that's what I'm saying. No, but the previous was different Playa, but usually with very small, very small distances, they have different names. So, do you want to go to this? To the right, or you still want to find uh, some way to eat in one of those cafes? Oh, it's police out there. Something is something is going on. No, they have a new law with those scooters. Maybe here they also have changed them. Definitely, you brought a new law with the scooters. So before you actually ride it in Gibraltar, read the rules. I don't ride it, so I don't know what the rules are. So. Oh, is that the rules now? Yeah. Didn't I have those before? No. Okay. That's why I want a bike, electric bike. Right, so. No helmet. So, shall we go to the right? Because it looks like it's very busy out there now, it isn't it? Busy, yes. It gets very busy and uh, it might be a little bit longer. Time is going to take us. So we've already been there. It looks lovely. And we're six and a half miles from the car now. Yeah, and, uh, and we have to go back to our car and let's. But do you think we'll find some way to have a lunch out there? <laughs> Instead, it's like all the cafes are here now. But we never walked. In this part, so I just thought, did we? Oh, actually, it does look uh, familiar, but it was like three years ago. It was before COVID. It's not changed. No, luckily, it's not changed. It still looks nice, clean, and uh, pretty. Yeah, but I remember this monuments. Actually, you're right. We were here. No, we, we, yeah, we were here with your mom, no? With yours. And with my mom, did we? Yes. <laughs> We took them <laughs> that far. <laughs> they don't usually go too far. But I mean, look how nice it is and all these flowers. That's what I'm saying. Why can't they do all of this, like put all these flowers in La Linea to make La Linea a little bit prettier? There aren't enough flowers to achieve that. Yeah. I mean, how nice it would be just put more flowers, make it more colorful, brighter. <sighs> oh, I think there will be a, a park at the end. Yes. Ah, yes, okay, I remember this. Yes, the park will be at the end. So, I guess we're going to the right then. But where is the old town? We have never ever went to the old town. I've never ever been, never ever went is not correct to say. So, that's what I said, no? <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, so where is the old town? I think old town must be up up the hill somewhere, no? I don't remember ever going to the old town. Yeah, that's the lovely park out there. 
There's more shade out there for you. But no places to eat. We have to go back then. <laughs> no, we're going. We will go to the right. Let's go to the right and find. Let's just. Uh, I'll show the map quickly. So, where does it say old town? I don't know. Where is old town? Plaza de los Naranjos. Ah, that's the uh, plaza. I don't know how far it is. It's Sveta was saying it's really nice. It should have all this uh, blossom of oranges. But I'm not. I don't know where it is from here. It's not this one, isn't it? I don't remember oranges in this one. I don't think it's the one. So, shall we go this way? Okay, we just continue our walk a little bit in town. Still uh, can't decide where to go for lunch just probably trying to get a little bit more of appetite oh look menu del dear daily menu it's all in spanish and it's uh, 10 years <laughs> you want to eat here it's interesting huh so i guess you're gonna have what the start uh, I don't know, we just like walked in something, but I don't know. Do you want to walk further or... I can't see much out there, so I suggest we can have a look at this place a bit more if you want. Okay guys, watch out. This menu of the day is in English also, so it includes first course, second course, bread, dessert, coffee, and for the price of 10 euros. So, and uh, that's the place. It's quite busy. Watch out. We decided to eat inside. Someone is starting his lunch with spaghetti for this. Look at this portion. It's huge. And it's only starter. Well, I'm having my salad. So it's a reasonable size. So I'll have enough space for for the rest. I have also bread. I already started to eat because I feel hungry. I have uh, also drink. So bon appetit. Okay, we're finishing with coffee, guys, but I forgot to make videos of that food. <laughs> well, man, it was all your fault. Old age. You interrupted me. Senility. Yeah, right. No, I'm just not me before my ear condition. <laughs> yes, okay. So, um, <laughs> yeah, we had Adam had turkey and I had uh, chicken. We had it with potatoes. It was really nice, actually, but yes, I forgot to make videos of it anyway. So, and uh, strangely, Adam decided not to have a dessert because it was dessert or, or coffee, and I not eating sweets now these days. And he decided not to eat it either. Yeah. I thought you were going to have ice cream at least. I could have had ice cream, but I thought it'd be good. Yeah? Yeah, you can buy me ice cream on the way out. Ah, well, if you're going to take me to the shopping center, then I might. Okay? <laughs> We are thinking to go to shopping mall, but I'm not sure if someone wants to go there. So we will see, it's getting late already, but uh, yeah. Okay guys, so we just left. It was a really nice meal. Quite big, so I don't know if we're gonna have any dinner tonight. <laughs> but uh, now we are going back and trying to find our car. So where we parked it, I don't know where exactly, but uh, I'm sure we're gonna find it. And, uh, in the shade is still a little bit chilly. No ice cream, I said. If we if we're going to the shopping center, <laughs> we're going. You, you might have an ice cream. So I still want to go to the shops. So we will see because it's like nearly four o'clock already. walk a little bit <laughs> compared to what well just nice day out compared to sitting at home at home well. and walking working all day <laughs> so i prefer to walk than to walk <laughs> than to walk <laughs> walk but not walk <laughs> so we just need to find where to turn we'll be driving this road no I don't, remember. don't you 
No. Well, I still can see the sea because we, where we parked, we couldn't see the sea from there. It was all, uh, all the buildings. Yeah, I'm sure it's not there, so we have a little bit. I'm sure it's a little bit further than it happens. I think so. Yeah, and I hope, and I still hope it's free, <laughs> post free parking, and we're still gonna have our car. And then we will have to run around trying to find where, where they take it. So, okay. See you later. Okay, guys, we made it. That's the shopping center, which is called La Cañada. So, uh, just want to go have a quick wander around the shops. I need something, yes. <laughs> I'm going to look for it. Maybe I'll leave Adam to wait for me. And then we will pop into the uh, supermarket to get some food. No. Yay! So here's the mall. And I don't really like to make videos inside. So I'm just uh, going to turn the camera off now. So, yeah. Are you coming with me or are you waiting for me? enough he can't even speak anymore he's so tired <laughs> and he didn't have his ice cream no ice cream for Adam <laughs> so okay well that's it for now guys so um, if you like the video as usual trying to bring you a bit of life in Gibraltar Spain too because Spain is on uh, five minutes across the border from us so uh, you ask for the videos just anything so here's just anything for you guys <laughs> okay see you later bye everyone don't forget to like subscribe and press the bell bye